<coughs> welcome again uh, this is the session two of day two of epi i'm going to solve two more questions and uh, it, those two questions will be followed by uh, assignments again <coughs> so the third question of the day the 15th term of an epi exceeds 20th term by 8 find a common difference so this is a very simple question um, the 15th term of an AP exceeds 20th term by 8 so the 15th term uh, is 8 more than the 20th term so you have to put that uh, as a mathematical expression and it's uh, correctly so solution let a and d be the first term and the common difference here a 15 should be equal to a 20 plus 8 <clears throat> remember the 15th term is 8 more than the 20th term so that means a 15 equal to a 20 plus 8 a 20 plus 8 So a plus 15 minus 1 d equal to a plus 20 minus 1 d plus 8. A and a cancel. Then 15 minus 1 is 14. 14 d equal to uh, 19 d plus 8. Now transfer the 19 d to the left hand side. 14 d minus 19 d equal to 8. So 14d minus 19d is minus 5. So minus 5d equal to 8. Then uh, d equal to minus 8 by 5. That's a, that's a simple uh, mathematical uh, calculation, which should be uh, easy for everyone. So that's the, uh, that's the question number 3 of AP day 2. Let's move on to question number 4. This should be question number four, even though uh, the question number is given as three. This should be question number four. Find the 15th term from the last term towards the first term of the AP 371123. Here's the thing about this question. You, we are to find the 15th term from the last term. That means the AP should reverse let's keep that in mind so the uh, according to the given ap 3711 uh, 3 is the first term according to that uh, according to the given ap but we are to find the 15th term from the last term so the 15th term from the last term uh, we need to reverse the uh, ap so that we can get the 15th term from the last term that makes uh, that will make the solution uh, a lot easier there's another way of doing but I'm not going to deal with the other way the other method so here the AP when you rewrite it uh, or when you reverse it it becomes 1 2 3 uh, 11 7 3 so here 1 2 3 becomes the first term since we are to find the 15th term from the last term the uh, reversing the AP um, makes sense so a equal to 1 2 3 as you reverse the uh, AP then the common difference you have to be very careful with this you will be tempted to write 11 minus 7 but it should be 7 minus 11 7 minus 11 which is minus 4 now we have to find the 15th term so let's write the formula of the nth term once a n equal to a plus n minus 1 d so a 15 equal to a value is 1 2 3 plus n value is 15 minus 1 multiply with d which is minus 4 so a 15 equal to 1 2 3 plus 14 into minus 4 so uh, the rest of the steps are uh, 
simple i hope everyone will be able to understand so minus plus into minus is minus so 14 into 4 is 56 so 1 2 3 minus 56 so f15 equal to 67 so the 15th term from the last term towards the first term would be 67 then uh, that's the fourth question uh, then ap uh, day two assignments question number three four five and six are given to, on the screen go through the questions uh, solve them if you can try well and good and if you can find the answers well and good if you cannot find the answer you please um, report it to me let me know and then we'll see what we can do about it if i can assist you uh, through the whatsapp well and good otherwise i will explain uh, in a video again Thank you.